What is up guys, it is Seattle Vegan Cyclist here, welcome back to another video. Today's a little bit of a get ready with me, kind of early morning, um, not really a vlog per se, just a little bit of a clip that I wanted to take before I head to class. Um, it's about 8.40, 8.40 right now, and I got class at 9, class is pretty close, so I usually leave it around 8.55-ish. Um, just doing a bit of my early morning, um, it's, this is new to me, but my dandruff routine. Um, I've had dandruff for a while. Probably since I was in middle school, and I haven't really seemed to be able to get rid of it. I've tried a lot of things, head and shoulders, all kinds of different crap. And um, I never really, like, took it too seriously. I really should have been, but um, this, I'm, this is something new I'm trying. I'm trying to, like, you know, scrape off. It sounds kind of gross, but I'm trying to, like, scape, scrape off all the dead skin, and then I'll probably do some more shampooing. I usually mainly shampoo when I do stuff like this, but ob like, that obviously hasn't worked. I mean, I've been doing that for ages, and nothing to really come of it. So now I'm going to be, you know, scraping all the flakes off, <clears throat> and um, hopefully that will begin to sort of take away some of the stuff that's been there for a while, and I can shampoo again, and maybe I'll have some, some more progress. It's already seeming a little better. I mean, last night it was, it was a lot heavier um, snowfall, if you catch my drift. So, I mean, I think it's going to take a while, but um, I think this is helping just because it is getting all of the dead, like a lot of the dead skin off. You probably can't even really see too much of the dandruff falling. Um, maybe you can, maybe you can't. I don't know. It doesn't look like it on this, but um, I guess I'm just trying to get a lot of the dead skin off. So that's what we're doing here. And then after this, I usually um, wash my face, and that way, um, um, you know, try and get more in the dead, of the dead skin off. But I think, I think what that does as well is it also. Um, Sort of just like wets it and then makes it look like it's gone, but it's not actually gone. So it's one thing that I want to work on as well. Today's going to be a bit of a busy day. I've got some um, applications to turn in and some applications to check on. Still looking for a job, so hopefully that goes well. And then I've got a I don't I, yeah. And then I'm going to do some flipping today. I'm going to go do some thrift stores out in um, the city. So that'll be good. And we'll try and maybe I'm thinking about getting a blender. So maybe we'll go find one of those at the thrift store. I don't want to spend too much time doing this because I've still got to do some uh, brushing my teeth and washing my face and stuff. So um, I guess I could probably take you guys with me for that, but I can't really because it's in the bathroom and someone might come in. Da -da -da -da, so I'll pause you guys for a second. And I'll be right back. Guys, the Seattle Vegan Cyclist here. Welcome back to another episode of the Flipping Chronicles, aka College Life, aka. Vegan gains. Anywho, um, today I did a little bit of grocery shopping and putting in a few job applications here and there. Sorry about the background noise. Um, I, I, I didn't do it as productively as I wanted to. I spent a few, like a little bit long in a few places. I didn't bring my bike with me, so I was walking around a little bit. But good to get outside and enjoy the sunlight before it, um, you know, hits winter and kind of don't really have that to enjoy. The bus should be here in about five minutes or so. I've been busting it mainly. I don't have my car out here, so it's kind of rough, but it's whatever. Um, I like, you know, using, uh, more environmentally friendly options anyways, but if I was smart, I would bring, bring in my bike out here, but I'm just worried about it getting, it getting stolen in the city or, um, having to deal with, you know, um, bringing my bags and stuff inside. So we'll see how that works out. I think I'm going to try it at least once. Um, and I finally ended up getting a blender. Got the Ninja here. If you know any good things about it, any bad things about it, let me know. Just wanted to get a simple blender. I, I found a Ninja earlier for like 14. I didn't pick it up. I was going to try and flip it, but um, the margins weren't that good. And I was like, worried about shipping and whatnot. But I got this one. Seems to be a little bit better. It's pretty high power. I tested it out. Um, it works out pretty good. So hopefully nothing too crazy is wrong with it. They do have a return policy on it. So, I mean, it's not that bad. But it's only in, it's only exchange. So, I mean, it's not the best, but it's whatever. Um, I wanted to. I was looking to get a few things to flip, but um, and the, the blender had some pretty good margins on it on eBay. I saw, but I'm gonna be using that, which is one problem that I have. Like I always buy stuff and then I end up using it. Another flip that I did get though was um, these things called Odd Socks. It's like a Family Guy Odd Socks. Um, so and they go for about 15. I picked it up for about five, so we'll probably throw it up on eBay for around 13 dollars. There was already some on there for about 13 dollars, but hopefully you know the market is decent. And I can get them sold within a little bit here. Um, I'm looking to move out next quarter, so I've got to start saving a little bit of money. Like I said, I've been applying to a few jobs here and there, so hopefully that works out. Um, I got to just start blasting out more applications. I've been pretty lazy about that, and I need to really set my game up on that. And um, also, I haven't been like waking up as early as I want to. I usually get up around like 8 a.m., which is super late for me. 
Um, I just, I don't, I don't know. I, I've been making up a bunch of excuses, like, um, and just doing that kind of stuff. So, but I have been getting into some better study habits lately. I went to the library last night with a couple of friends, and we, uh, you know, studied. I did my work. I got to finish up a few essays. Now that I think about it, actually, I need to go to the library tonight. I, I need to be going to the library every day, basically, and I need, I need to be working out in the mornings every day as well. And I think I see my bus hopefully. Um, but yeah, just trying to get into better routines and habits. I've been like getting inspired by a lot of people that I see and um also you know at the same time I'm just like wow like they're out here doing this and like you know like here I am but you know comparison is a fast track to misery so I just try and you know find my lane and here's the bus actually I gotta let you guys go all right peace out what is up guys it's Seattle Vegan Cycles here for the last clip of this little get ready with me slash flipping chronicles slash grocery haul video I was gonna do them separately but I figured why not just combine all three um but here um today was a relatively small haul it's got a few things I also got a um a, I guess we'll start it off. I got this bad boy right here, a Ninja 1000 watt blender for 20 bucks, as you can see here. Not too bad of a deal. They go for like 100 on eBay, so I figured if it doesn't work out too well, maybe I'll just you know try and flip it or something or do something like this. But I think I will use it just because I do need a blender. So that's gonna go over in my um, food area. Next up on the grocery haul list here, we have my dinner for tonight probably with a few other things but we got this bad boy right here some light life meatless bowls i got the teriyaki tempeh version they had a few other ones i don't know the names of the other ones but this one looked the most appetizing to me so i figured you know what i'll go for this bad boy right here um it's got tempeh peas carrots all kinds of fun stuff bell peppers i think this will be pretty tasty i don't know if i'll make it now or a little bit later but i am kind of hungry so i may just make it meow but i think i'm gonna have a smoothie right now which you guys will also see is the next thing up on my list of um, things that I got at the grocery store. The first two bags are, boom, some organic mangoes. My One of my favorite fruits and one of my favorite ways to consume it, smoothies. So that is always good. Put those in the freezer over here. I've basically created a monopoly on the freezer. It's all mine with all the fruit and such. Um, and the second, the penultimate item on my list of um, things that I wanted to get today was some strawberries. This goes, I used to do mango strawberry smoothies, or I'll do, you know, just strawberries. And also, I obviously add sugar, you know, key ingredient of life. Boom. That makes up that. And last but not least, on my. Uh, Grocery haul here is dun, da, da, da. some pasta sauce because I had way too much pasta and not enough sauce. So boom, got two more jars of pasta sauce. I don't know how long these will last me, but hopefully they last for the last bit of pasta that I do have. I now have three jars of pasta sauce, so we will see if that is enough. And they also give me a uh, $3 coupon, which I have a few of these. I have not been using them, but hopefully I'll use it for my next purchases of stuff here at the store because they do have good deals on organic fruit. So um, I'll try and stay up on that. Who knows if I will or not. I highly doubt it, but I should be anyways. Um, yeah, that's, that's about it for this grocery haul. And this video, I want to thank you guys for watching today. Um, hopefully it wasn't too long for you. Other than that, don't forget to... Go vegan or go home. Crab the fuck up. Action the fuck up. Stand in for what you believe in. Sit the fuck back down. This is Cone signing out. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace.